Hey everyone, it's me, Ariel Asian, and today we're going to talk about what Blair White missed during the debate between her and Jessica Yaniv. I'm going to use the she pronoun to refer to Yaniv in order to prevent repercussions. The first thing that Blair missed was proving that the messages were real. She didn't effectively argue about why those messages are real, because Blair asked Jessica why those messages could be photoshopped, which is difficult to prove. It seems that Blair just asserted that those messages were real without saying the evidence. There was a video in which Jessica Yaniv tried and failed to hit up other girls online. There was also footage from Benjamin Boyce about a voice recording in which Jessica Yaniv justified sending those messages to girls. It's ironic that Jessica is denying that she sent those messages despite her making a recording. There's also a video in which a girl opens a message that Jessica sent to her. The proof that Yaniv sent those Elmo voice recordings to Jessica Rumpel kind of proves that she sent inappropriate messages to young girls. The second thing that Blair missed was the messages sent to Jess Rumpel. Blair did not clarify that part correctly. I believe that she could have destroyed Jessica Yaniv if she could have said Rumpel's name and the content of these voice messages, which was specifically Elmo messages, she incorrectly said that those were baby messages and asked Yaniv if she had a baby fetish. I feel like Blair missed the moment when she would have said to Yaniv, you said I love you too, Jess Rumpel, which the video shown that you sent it directly to Jess Rumpel. So it was kind of confusing for Jessica Yaniv to know what Blair meant. I also kind of believe that maybe Yaniv was correct that she sent them to her other friend when one of the messages said, Elmo wants to have a threesome with you and Jess Rumpel. So there's sort of the truth that Yaniv sent them to one of her friends. Maybe Blair did not use Rumpel's name because of privacy reasons, or maybe she forgot. I feel like there were missed opportunities and things that Blair should have said. That doesn't mean that the debate was bad. Blair really did destroy Jessica Yaniv in other parts of the debate. It just means that she missed those things. Thanks everyone for watching the video. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.